Uh, hello friends, today in this tutorial I will basically show you a PDF editor and a PDF viewer where you can add your annotations, drawing in uh, in the, you can modify the PDF document. So this is basically the application that I developed inside uh, HTML, CSS and JavaScript and it is using the JS PDF and HTML2 PDF JS library and for rendering out the PDF, we are using the PDF.js library. So this is the demo of the application, guys. You will see it on your screen right here. We are, if you load this application in the browser, a PDF file will be loaded here. And now you can draw annotations. So we have a pencil icon. You can highlight anything here in the PDF document. You can highlight this one, this thing. And you can change the color. Uh, we have the drop down here you can change it to green color red color you can just select any color of your choice and then we have this uh, PDF viewer you can go to any page in the PDF document uh, if you have multiple PDF documents here just load this so now you can see we have uh, 14 pages right here in this PDF document and uh, we can navigate to the second page, third page, fourth page. And right here, if, if you want to do some highlighting here, if you want to do annotation, let's suppose I want to highlight this paragraph with this text here, we will select the pencil icon. Then we will select this uh, or highlight this paragraph. You can see we are doing the annotation. We have modified the PDF. We can even draw some shapes as well. You can even draw a square shape to highlight something here. You can see that. So very easy stuff guys. This is the application and we can even draw a circle as well. This is a circle tool. So this is the code which is available guys if you see index.html. You just need to load this code here in your file and uh, then you can add as many shapes as you want. You can add a circle here. You can even add a oval as well like this. Anything that you want to highlight guys, you can do that and place it anywhere on the screen by this select tool, which is available. And then you can even draw something here. So let's suppose if you want to draw. If you want to write something here in the text area. You can change the highlighting here uh, physically. Just select this and write something here. You can now see we have six, six, six. You can see that we can just change it. You can even change the font size as well. Just select it from whichever phone that you want. We can even have arrows as well if you want to highlight some arrows in the PDF document. You can even do that also. We have this one also. If you want to do this, you can even do this. Just change it in green color, any color you can do. So you can navigate to the next, next page. If you want to do this, you will see that. It's very easy guys. And if you want to add an image, let's suppose we can also add an image. You can see. We can even clear out this image and let's suppose I select this image. Now I can even add this image at any location. We can even add images, highlight, annotate and uh, it's line width you can also control by 8 pixels. So if you now have, you can see that. So you can basically hide something in the PDF document, annotate, highlight, you will see that. So the link is given guys in the description of the video if you want to get the full source code of this application, this tool. Uh, you can purchase it from PayPal in United States dollar or you can go to stripe.com and make the payment in Indian rupees. So I have made this tool and uh, the libraries that we have used is JS PDF and HTML2 PDF JS library. And after you make the changes guys, you just need to simply click this button. So it will save the modified changes into a new PDF document. So if you now open this, you will see all the highlighting which you have done in the previous steps are being saved and this is the first page in the PDF document. This is the next page. If you see, we have successfully added the image as well. 
so this is basically the editor guys uh, nice little editor where we can edit the files in the PDF document so 14 pages are there so in this way guys you can make the modifications and then export your changes whatever changes that you have done and uh, it makes it very much easy so the link is given guys you can directly purchase it and uh, after that you will get a zip file you just need to extract it and then you just need to open this index.html file and this application will load for you if you want to change the pdf file guys simply go to the folder called as a sample and here just uh, inside your code if you see in index.html you just need to in the source directory we have javascript code so just change and paste your uh, pdf file whichever pdf file you need to edit and uh, here you just need to in the sample now let's suppose we want to load this file next handbook so now after you make this change this is our uh, custom PDF file that we so now it is loading this file so now you can see it has successfully loaded my custom PDF file here so you can see that it contains 54 pages and now I can basically highlight this file here with you can see it's very easy if you want to save these changes save it and it will now save these changes So in this way guys you can do this if you want to highlight these changes you can see that so So in this way guys you can do this and the link is given in the description of the video you can directly uh, purchase the full source code and I will be seeing you in the next video.